Kamen got to know his other self very early in life. While he was a teenager, Kamen started his own company, building and selling control systems for automated sound and light shows. He was still in high school when he got the contract to automate the Times Square New Year's Eve ball. Though he went on to attend university, he never bothered to graduate because he was too busy working on something he called auto syringe, the first wearable infusion pump for administering drug therapies. His invention was hailed as a medical landmark, as were many of his other breakthroughs, which include a revolutionary kidney dialysis machine, an insulin pump for diabetics, an improved stent used for heart patients, and more than 150 other devices he has patented. One day, seeing the difficulty a man in a wheelchair was having getting up a curb, Kamen set his mind to creating a device that would liberate people confined to wheelchairs. The result is the iBot, a revolutionary wheel device that uses computers and a system of stabilizing gyroscopes that imitate the working of the human body. It not only goes over curbs, but it will even go up and down stairs, travel over almost any kind of rough ground, and will allow the user to raise themselves eye to eye with a standing person. And it does it all without the user having to get out of the device or needing anyone's assistance. In 2001, came and hit the front pages when he introduced the Segway, a one-person people mover based on his iBot technology. It's a two-wheel scooter-like device that zips and zooms forward, backward, left, right, and comes to a stop without the rider doing anything more than barely shifting his or her body. It is so sensitive that it is almost as though it obeys the user's thoughts. The Segway may be a world-changing invention, with possible applications for work and travel that stagger the imagination. As this is being written, the Segway is already being used to navigate large warehouses and is being tested by police departments and postal employees. While traffic cops in City Hall wrangle over whether the Segway belongs on the sidewalk or the road, Dean Kamen is dreaming a new dream. This time, the dream is an invention that may literally bring light to some of the darkest corners of the Earth. Kamen has developed a non-polluting electric generator that can use almost anything as fuel. But here's the extraordinary part. He has created a revolutionary closed system so that the engine's heat is used to purify 10 gallons of drinkable water every hour. This amazing invention could bring safe drinking water to parts of the world where contaminated water kills millions. And at the same time, it will provide a source of cheap, reliable electric power. Dean Kamen is not some academic hidden in a lab somewhere. Kamen is an inventor. But like Thomas Edison, he is also an entrepreneur and businessman creating and marketing devices that are changing the public perception of what an inventor is.